I have tried as much as possible to carry everyone with me. Uh, I would not expect in any case that uh, if you have done your work well as a party leader, that you would not have stepped on the toes of some people. If you do not take decisions, then you are not a leader. But if you take decisions uh, in a party, then you must you know, find some people who do not like those decisions. Uh, the National Republican Convention was the only party that established a its own mini national electoral commission in the party. We had what they call the Republican Electoral Commission in our party. The Republican election, like Electoral Commission dealt with all election matters. Uh, where primaries had a problem, it went to an appeals panel. The chairman of the appeals panel was the deputy national chairman of our great party. There was no time that I was in any way directly involved in the running of the affairs of the Republican Electoral Commission or the appeals when they came from the states. Our move is an attempt to actually preserve what we consider to be the spirit of our party and not allow it to be hijacked or perverted by any individual aspirations or any individual persons. The original idea was that he was interested in becoming the president at the outset of the Abuja Convention. Many people believed this. Um, after a while, it shifted to the fact that he wanted to be the vice president of the country. Again, many people believed this. Rightly or wrongly, I don't know. Um, the idea was then for him to remain as chairman of the party, manipulate party machinery, and ensure that one of his closest friends from the north uh, emerges in the presidential primaries as the candidate. Again, this cannot be substantiated by me, though others claim that it can be by them. His conduct of the gubernatorial primaries, uh, something that left a lot of us with a very, very bitter taste in our mouths. We were very worried as to why he and others did what they did. There are a lot of glaring uh, discrepancies, a lot of uh, uh, dissatisfaction occurred in many of the states. And the question that came to the minds of everybody is precisely what is this man planning to do? Why is he allowing this sort of thing to happen? And if he's not part of it, why doesn't he put a stop to it? The fact of the matter is many people believe today that the conduct of the gubernatorial primaries was an attempt to prepare the ground for what can only be described as a massive atrocity when the presidential primaries comes. In other words, an attempt to impose a candidate on the party.